Hey guys, gals of course. Dave Aqua Health Technologies, Boston. Talking about water hammer again, protecting your plumbing system. Can't compress the liquid. Thus, that's why we have hydraulics. And when you turn the solenoid on and off the wash machine, especially the dishwasher, like this gentleman will show us here, he's going to install these water hammer arresters that we put in. Here we go. Hi guys, today we're going to be tackling an issue which is very common in a lot of households, which is water hammer caused by the washing machine. Water hammer is basically the shaking, rattling, or banging of your water distribution pipes when the water is being shut off abruptly. Washing machines and dishwashers are the most common causes of water hammer. This is due to using a solenoid valve to open and close the water to the appliance. This abrupt stoppage in water can cause damage to the water distribution system. A water hammer arrestor can be used to fix this issue. He uses a air cushion to absorb the impact exactly of the stoppage of water. So let's start with showing you the water hammer, then we'll install these water hammer arrestors and show you how well they work. I'm going to use us here in shared and a lifetime warranty, by the way. Okay guys, first steps first is turning the hot and cold off to the washing machine and then we'll remove the hoses. There'll be a little bit of water left in the hoses, so uh, put a towel down. It's a great time to inspect the condition of the hose, uh, if there's any leaks or anything like that. The one part you're going to want to inspect is the crimp joint. This is the most common um, spot that it'll burst if, if that were to That's occur. That's why we have flood safe uh, hoses. Especially on the black hoses. If there's a bubble it's here, on uh, just on the crimp joint, replace them as soon as possible. Um, the other thing is when you remove the hoses, if there's a screen, either uh, on the washing machine side or the hose side, is just to inspect it and remove any debris, if there's any there. So, and keep note of which side the hoses were connected on so you put it back hot and cold correctly. So I'll be installing the OD Quiet Pipes hammer arresters designed specifically for the washing machines. The reason I like these ones is they have a longer stem to actually clear the back of the washing machine. So let's just unpack these and uh, try to keep the than a half. I don't want to over tighten these so no you don't. Metal on plastic. And there's no need for Teflon tape on this as they use the the O ring no, uh, or the, the washer as, as the seal. I can't go now to just up the hoses back up. Uh, just inspect the washer before installing, make sure it's not damaged uh, and you can install it the same Um, even after we run the washing machine, you're going to want to double check all the connections as well. So I'm just going to push the uh, washing machine back. You always want to be careful not to smash these into the back of the wall. So uh, just move it back. Just be careful how they, they don't get bent up. You can see here that the hoses have stopped shaking and the pipes have stopped banging. Exactly. Excellent. Hi guys, I hope this video helped you out and cured your water hammer issue. Uh, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Okay, if uh, you like no, videos okay. like this one, feel Absolutely. free to subscribe as we're always putting out new content. And remember, never stop learning. Yeah, nice segue. Dave, Aqua Health Technologies, Boston Mass. Shout out to John, Media Master. Thank you, John, for all you do. K25 Technology. He'll have a link on the site soon. Adam will as well. Adam Sloan, Corporate Attorney. Please like, share, subscribe. I would really appreciate that. I like educating you all. And let's do some business. Thank you.